YouTube, how are you doing? And welcome to Sinister Entity. This game is incredible. It is also incredibly janky, but this is one of the most ambitious games I've ever seen made by a single developer. This is an indie game with full cutscenes, voice acting, and all kinds of other wild stuff that I really hope you enjoy. If you're not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. But let's not waste any more time. Let's hop into the game. Let's go. What in the hell? Hi. <laughs> what is going on? It's a damn music video. Alrighty then, what an intro. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Sinister Entity. Alright, we're going in. Sinister Entity. <laughs> Dude. What is going on? Resident Evil. <laughs> Hi. I will try again. It's Frankenstein. She's freaking dead, bro. It's Heisenberg. Jesse, we got to cook. What is he doing? Castus corpus incubus necromancers. Emok belzamok treham sojash. Castus corpus incubus necromancers. Did he enable the Emok reverb on his voice? She's gonna open her eyes. They actually... Uh, she's gone. Well, it worked! Let's go, dude! Oh my god! <laughs> what did you think was gonna happen? Alright. I like the intro. It's a little stiff here and there, but uh, I mean, dude, this is only a short game, and they did all this stuff. This is very ambitious. Hi. Old How difficult it is for one of us to lose someone dear to their heart and to spend the rest of their life without them. So what if the mother was the one we lost? Oh, she's crying. Rip. My story started two weeks after my mother died. The cause of her death was unknown. And her behavior in the recent period was strange. She used to hear voices calling her and see things we don't see. Until <laughs> what we is thought going on? that she like had so gone crazy. Happening. My father's behavior was also strange. As if he knew the secret behind it. I have this never played me. an indie game like this. Well, I'm kind Sandman. of digging it. And this is my story. I have never played a, an indie game made by like one one like indie what dev that actually on? has cutscenes and everything and it's like a 30 minutes to an hour long experience Alrighty, well here we go uh how to play to move the character to wsd uh mouse uh, interact left click okay thank you we have can i read notes what language is this is that Ara arabic or arabic uh text uh, what is going on? Go and see what is going on inside the house. I'm gonna check this first, though. I need- I don't need to go to the bathroom. What if I need to pee, though? Anyway. I was dramatically looking outside the window. I wanna check it out. What's going on? It's kinda sick. So this is all made by one dev, by the way. Just- just before you start being, Oh, Miss Grammar, grammar mistake, haha. -ha. The sound is coming from the hall, not from this room. How to run? <laughs> My guy, I've played a game before. You don't have to tell me. 
Pantry is not the best time. It is. This is not the best time to make coffee. This house is big. We're rich. I'm just clicking on every door. I want a little notes. Oh, never mind. This is the right door. Uh, what is it going to say here? Bedroom. My parents' room. We look quite old, though. I guess we're a teenager. What the hell is going on? It has good lighting. Look the the god rays, the shadows. Um, more cutscenes, baby. Here we go. <laughs> actually a pretty s normal reaction honestly mom impossible oh this is her mother okay dude just fucking cinematic as hell bro Come to your mother. <laughs> <laughs> dude the movement though <laughs> this is amazing. I'm having a great time. <laughs> Tippy tapping. Uh oh. Peekaboo. Oh my god! I have to run away! Uh, run and hide before the demon kills you! Run! You can hide under the sofa near you by using the left mouse button when you are close, or by using... Okay. Uh, sofa. I see. Um... She probably saw that, no? Oh, easy peasy. You're walking to the right, though. Are you are you gonna be roaming the place now or what? With the crouch? I can't seem to. Oh, I press C, which only lowers the camera. It doesn't. Make, oh no, it does make her crouch. Is she still here? Um. No, Jill! What the fuck? Okay, so she went that way. Unfortunate. Hide! Oh my god. I love that you walk up to this and then just not check the couch. You're like, hmm, my stress. Wait, I don't see her walk to the left there. You see, I don't see. The footsteps go that way, so that's why I assumed she wasn't there. Okay, I have to crouch. Okay. No way. Let's be sneaky. Is this my mom? No. I can't believe my eyes. What is going on here? I have to escape from the house and call for help. We will do this. I should escape from the house before it's too late. Move quietly. I was already crouching. You can crouch by pressing C. Uh, can also crawl by holding C. The camera location can be switched by pressing F. Oh, dude. Let's go. I see. I can crawl all over the floor. I'm gonna be crouch mode. Don't see me. I can like peek around the corner. I actually appreciate this so much more than like the other, the like actually peeking. Moving your camera. The rule of thirds, baby. Gotta have your character not in the center of the screen. I'm just gonna walk to the door and pretend. No! Go, 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 go! Uh, the door's not gonna open. I'm gonna die. Oh, never mind. I'm alive. <laughs> What? Oh my god! 
Really fun. <laughs> Dad. Dad is fucking dead. The music, yeah. Oh, she's gone. I have to go to my dad's research room. I'm sure I'll find him there. Okay. Can I get the knife? I will become another victim if I don't find a way out of here. Take the knife and stab the ghost! Okay, we need to go through the research room. Where is the research room? This house is fucking massive. I'm assuming it's that big door there. This- or this white door here. Door is closed. Fuck me, man. I don't need to enter this room. Yeah, I wish there were not this many rooms. I don't need to go to the bathroom. Okay, there we go. The room where my father spends most of his time and prevents us from entering it. Okay. We got a safe with a puzzle, a four digit code. Nothing significant, just a, wait, no, I want to read the note. Uh, the fuck? We have Pac-Man with a bunch of swirlies with, I don't know what that is. Do I have to count something here? Is this the code? Hmm, hieroglyphic numbers. Oh. I have to decipher this code. I see. Your bag, you can open your bag by pressing I. You can switch between tabs by pressing ta uh required icon okay you can read the notes and memos that you've taken recently by clicking on them okay so i and we can read i see my we can read the note old books and artifacts i'm just checking around nice picture the journal dagger box i hit the dagger of the dead inside the chest in the secret basement and put the pieces that open it in different places in the house i put the first piece inside the safe and i changed the number also and i put the second piece inside the statue of isis or isis i think the the like uh, egyptian lady god and i put another one inside the wooden pazuzu statue and I put another piece in one of the pictures in the library, and to get it, the events must be arranged by pressing the button on each picture, and I hit the last piece inside the chest of the four Anubis statues. Then you can go through the Queen Cleopatra's gate and take the dagger. This is too complicated, bro. This is too much. Okay, so first one is in the safe. Check. I think we'll just go for that one first, and then we'll read this again. I have to collect these pieces and yes. get this dagger, or I will become another victim of this demon. Manuscript talisman, blah blah blah. An oil painting of Cleopatra. The cat, cats of a special symbolism, yeah yeah. There's something on the table. My wife! I have to do it tonight. I have to prepare the soul of my wife, Nadine. No one knows that I took her body from the mortuary after I made an arrangement with the person responsible there and bury another body in her place that will prepare her soul by which I will know where the jar she hid. I know that this act is a great risk to my life, but it does not matter. I have to take back the wish jar. No ma Why is there only commas? In There's, what the fuck? You see this punctuation? This is the longest sentence I've ever seen in my life. This, there's not been a period this whole fucking time. There are only commas. I know this act is a great lift to my life, but it does not matter. I have to take back the wish jar no matter what it costs me. And if things get out of hand, I can use the dagger of the dead in the wooden chest. I have studied some ancient manuscript and studied some... And now they just stopped using commas altogether. Some methods 
black magic used in the past and it is time to apply what I learned. When this incarnation is repeated twice and in the correct way as I wrote in the book of Aziv and the ancient manuscript, there is hope that this dead person will rise and can talk to him. I must summon a Dean spirit and speak with her and find out where she hit the jar. That was one giant sentence. <laughs> there was only commas. <laughs> my God, what is this, my father? What is going on here? Scrolls, spells, and demons. Did my father summon my mother's soul? Why did you do this, dad? Oh, wait, what is this? Oh, there's a key, a study room key. Aha! Okay, you can use items in your bag, such as keys by sitting in front of the required door and using the correct key. Okay, let's just explore around. Uh, maybe there's gotta be something with this, but we tried like every single combination of like reading from every direction, every order. So let's just uh, go use this key. The key to my father. Oh, here. Father's study room, second floor. Okay, thank you for telling me that. I appreciate. Save game. To save your progress, you must first go to Salma's room, then go to the office and press the left mouse button or press... Okay. Salma's room is located on the second floor and it is the room from which the game started. The room is a safe place and the devil will not be able to enter this room. Okay, this is complicated, dude. Yeah, I'm digging the ambition, though. So we need to go back to where we started. Oh, God. I have to be careful. What the fuck? What the fuck is going on? I can't see shit, bro. Why does my vision keep going blacking out? Excuse me? I'm looping her. Looper. Was that intended? <laughs> what is going on? Why is it fading to black when I look that direction? Huh? It's like when I look at the demon, my vision goes black. That seems a little fucked up, don't you think? I'm sneaking. Oh, that's just a carpet. That's not blood. I want to go back. No! What is happening? Okay, so you can't look at the demon. She... Wait, something is bugged. There's no way this is supposed to be like this. Right? That's going to make looping very hard. Oh, no. No! Okay, I'm looping a demon that I can't look at because when I look at the demon, it fucking fakes my entire screen to black, so... This is a little difficult. I have to, like, on purpose look away. Okay, we actually lived. <laughs> what the fuck? I want to save the game real quick because I don't know what the hell is happening. Save. There we go, save. I'm going to quickly restart the game just because I feel like something is broken. So, let's quickly restart. Sinister entity. I love the <laughs> Resident Evil. Okay, let's go. We're good. We still got everything, right? Yeah, we still got everything. So on the second floor, uh, there is Dad's study. Oh, we can check out different rooms now as well. Okay. Was this what it told me before? I don't need to go here. It looks pretty good. The music is being mighty creepy. I feel like we're gonna figure out... We could look up the hieroglyphics, like, on Google. I mean, people already did. But let's assume first that we'll just find it somewhere. Store door is closed. Dad, study! Here we go. Okay. Open the door. Nice. Okay. Now, please don't come in here. What the hell? This room is so red. <laughs> it's the most red room of all time. The fuck? What do we got here? We have another key. You got the store key. Okay, we already found that door. What's going on here? Open. It's just a big O red open button. Isis crystal. To get the Isis crystal, you must use the remote control in the storeroom to open the secret door. Okay, we can secret do that. Secret room in the store? Secret room in the store. 
Oh god. The music makes me think that something is close. The store was over there, right? It was to the side? Wasn't it? Am I insane? Or was it back here? Thought it was here. Can't see shit. It was this room, right? Oh my god! What the fuck? Run! Looper. Looper ass. Okay, she's back to being haunted and normal though. Go, go, go. Did get absolutely looped. Open the door. No, she saw me. Close the door. Oh, fuck. She's gonna open the door. Oh, no. No, I have to loop her. Loop, 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 loop. Ah, oh, shit. This sucks. I don't think. Oh, no. I don't think you're supposed to play the game this way. Zelma. I think you're supposed to be sneaky and stuff. I'm not sneaky, though. Go fuck yourself. You can't see me. Click the fucking remote! Secret room! No! No! <laughs> okay, I should. I was trying to speedrun, bro. Uh, come on. <laughs> Alright, we'll just hide this time. God damn it. Secret room in the store? I don't know why that's just so funny to me. Alright, here we go. Okay, now I'm still gonna be greedy here. I wanna try if we can hide on- That's never gonna work. Cause she's gonna jump scare us, right? Yeah, okay. So what we're gonna do here is a quick, uh, quick loop plus hide. The loop plus hide combo. You come this way. And then we go... Room, room, room. And then- OH! She cut me off! <laughs> I was gonna hide under the couch in the hallway. She actually scared the Sinister shit out of me. Entity. Dude, she was so fucking slow that she looped me. I've been out looped. The looper has been looped. Secret room in the store? Secret room in the store? <laughs> We're gonna hear that many times. Alright, this time, you're not gonna loop my ass. Ah! What if we do this? Will she just see me? Probably yes. No? That works? Alright, well that's... <laughs> that's a good strategy. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> that's way better than looping. Is she just gonna be stuck here forever? Do you go away? Are you supposed to loop her? Wait. Huh? Oh no. Are you kidding me? She's here forever. I broke the AI, I think. No, we have to die. She knows, dude. All right. Well, I guess that's not the way. <laughs> okay. Looping it is. <laughs> what the fuck, man? Sinister entity. Why does it say that every time I die? Just in case I forgot what game I was playing. Secret room in the store? <laughs> I'm gonna lose my mind, dude. All right, lady. Uh, we could just go all the way back. You suck. We could go all the way back here and just hide in a different area. That might be easier, huh? That's probably what the game wants me to do. You know what? We could actually take this time to just quickly run this way and save the game. Uh... So then we don't have to do this again. Why is she so loud? Don't ask questions. There we go. We are saved. Now we just run. And then we also don't have to hear the secret room in the store again. We can go to the secret room in the store. Okay, the eye disappeared. Does that mean I can run now? She's not, like, looking for me anymore? Yeah. Close. Up. 
There we go. I totally could have done this if I was slightly faster, by the way. What do I get? I got a crystal. Now we put this somewhere? What do we do with that again? It's got to say it somewhere. A super beautiful red crystal piece, but what do I use it for? That's what I'm asking. Probably in here, there's like a note. Maybe. This is kind of sick. Dad's study. He said something about it, right? Don't you... Oh, it actually pauses the game. Okay, good. Um, dagger box. In the statue, right? Put the second piece inside the statue of uh, Isis or Isis. Where is that statue? We didn't get another key. I don't know where the statue... Is it downstairs? There's gotta be statues around somewhere. Selma! Selma! Selma balls! I was gonna make a joke, but then I screamed it instead because she was in a different area than I expected. <laughs> Just get the shit out of me. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, let's hide. <laughs> I didn't mean to say it like that. I should have just ran to the safe room. No, don't get me again. Don't. Okay. He's walking away. Please. All right, I'm gonna go now. I need to save. He can't be in the safe room, so we're just gonna go here again. I know we're, we're, we're cheesing, but what the hell happened to your hand? Dude? No, you can't be here. You're not allowed to be here. This is a safe room. Fuck you. Right? Okay, so what do we do now? We have... We need to get it from the statue of... Where are these statues? I don't remember seeing them. Can you go away, lady? Rest in peace, lady. You have also been stabbed. Can we go in here? I don't need to go to the bathroom. You guys got 17 bathrooms in this house, man. <laughs> Every other room is a bathroom. What the fuck? We can look up the hieroglyphs, but I feel like that... Why would they assume that people know the hieroglyphs? There's no way that they would assume that you know that. Like, obviously, we can Google them. Oh, wait. A secret door. Where will it lead me? I was just clicking buttons, bro. All right. <laughs> I was just spamming. All right, we do not have to open the safe yet. <laughs> Excuse me, game. Oh. What is going on? Oh, it's a table where the thing happened. My God. Oh, here we're going to learn about the hieroglyphs. Yeah, here we go. Why would you scream? <laughs> why would you attract the demon? Oh, that's why. <laughs> but still. Jesus. Rip. Dad! Dude, this is so cinematic. <laughs> I think this is like what <laughs> secretly one of my favorite horror genres is like indie games that try to be super cinematic and ambitious. I know that I'm talking over this lady crying. I'm sorry, but <laughs> the more janky like a cinematic game is, the more fun, honestly. <laughs> this is like an emotional moment there. I'm sorry. Uh-oh. 
Oh, hide. I have to hide. <laughs> Easiest hiding of my life. I've played enough Phasma to know these guys. We could also just loop around the table forever. Do we have this much time to hide? Oh, there we go. There she comes. That was so long. Is this a different person? Wait, she's wearing different clothes this time. Wait, what the fuck? Why is your middle of your body not a... Huh? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> your torso is missing. <laughs> the torso isn't rendered. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> <laughs> is that part of the game? Or is that just broken? <laughs> Looks like a completely different person. Okay. Is it a ghost? Anyway. Uh, what do we got here? We got a new key. Library key. There we go. Nothing interesting here. Ah! What is wrong with you? Oh, hi. What the fuck? Where did you come from? What the fuck? Huh? Why? I thought the lights spooked her or something. We were so dead. Run. Oh my. What? What is going on? Run, 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 run. I can go into the library. I should actually save the game. We've done so many things right now. Stop saying so much. Yeah, I'm gonna save the game real quick. And then we're going over to the library. Also, I lost her. Get wrecked. I'm so much faster than she is. Alright, save game. Now we're just gonna run. And we'll see if we can. We can do the... this way. And then we just go downstairs here. We take the sneaky path. I'm starting to learn the layout of this house. And then we just go in. No! Whatever, whatever, just run. We got this right. It's It pauses in the menu. I sure as hell hope so. Run! Oh, she lost me. How did she lose me? This is an insane library. What the fuck is this house, dude? Wish urn. This jar is very old and dates back to the time of the Babylonian and Mesopotamian civilizations. They say that it has the ability to fulfill wishes, but its side effect may be dangerous for some people, as it is possible for some to imagine that they see the dead or that they hear voices calling them and that some have died in a strange way. Are we going insane? Is that what's happening? Is this not real? This isn't real? Is he gonna come in here? Please don't come in here. This is actually insanely large. Oh, the paintings! Yeah, we needed to do something with the paintings. Okay. There were buttons at the paintings, right? <coughs> the Pazuzu statue! We need to break Pazuzu. that one. Pazuzu. Pazuzu, mm. whatever. Uh, the Pazuzu statue. Don't... Don't smoke that. Uh, we need to click button somewhere, but I'm checking this first. Oh, what did I do? I used the key. Okay, now we can loop through the library. Here. No. I'm gonna click these buttons. Okay, let's see. What order do we click them in? We have Baby. We have Shneko. We have Dedo. We have also Baby. Okay, so baby... Didn't they have to put the babies in the... Like, what was that with the babies in the river? Wasn't that like a thing in Egyptian times where they just like drowned a bunch of babies in the, in the Nile or something? I forgot the story. Do we... What order do we click this in? They put the baby in the basket, right? They put the baby in the basket. Then they... This is also baby. What is this thing here? Do we have Pharaoh? He's fine. Oh, this is the river. Oh, the water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see, I see. And then what's with the snake? They found the baby. So, so I'm assuming they find the baby here. So this is one. 
Well, this painting shows the mother of the prophet Moses as she puts her baby in the basket and sadness fills her. Do you want... Okay, here we go. Let's read them. Uh, a painting of a large snake in front of a pharaoh and he is very afraid. That is like the... The payback, right? Something like that. This is the water. But the painting shows the army of the pharaoh drowning in the sea after they try to catch up with the prophet Moses. Yes. The painting shows one of the maids who found the baby inside the basket. Okay. The painting shows Pharaoh talking to one of them. His eyes filled with anger. Okay, so let's see. Um, it's uh, We need to click the buttons in the right order, right? The painting shows one of... So finding or putting away first? So putting up... I'm assuming... This is the start. Then they find the baby. And then what? Then they find the baby, bring it to the pharaoh. There's there's so much missing here, though. <laughs> and then it's... I feel like it's this one. And then this one. This one? The drowning is the last one, right? I think it's this order, but I feel like there's a lot missing here. Then snake. And then this. Yes. I got the Archangel Key. Where did it come from? I don't know. But we did it. Alrighty. Uh, now we need to break the statue, right? We use it? Just throw it on the ground. Pazazu, apparently. Why is do you pronounce this as an A and that as a U? I don't... Uh, language. Uh, it's the demon of the wind known for bringing famine during dry seasons and locusts during rainy seasons. I think I have to put it somewhere. Okay. So we need to... There was still another key though, right? Let's see. So that is one. Then we need... The Anubis statue one. Do we get another key as well? No, we didn't get another key. We need to put it... What is it? Oh, here! Are these the Anubis statues? Yes. Okay. Oh. I see. It's one of these. Is that what I was supposed to do? That's what I would try to do. Is that not I'm supposed to make them look at me, of course. Oh, there we go. <laughs> nice. Okay, that was easy. So now where do we put the statue? And then we still need to figure out how to... I'm gonna fucking die if you don't let me run away, sir! Lady! Okay, okay. These damn scripted encounters, man. I'm so much faster. Get wrecked? What's over here? Can I read something over here? A cassette player. I'm still just... Oh, there we go. Dagger of the Dead. Let me read this real quick. A unique antique masterpiece. I got it from an, from one of the antiquities seller in Iraq. And it is one of the seven existing daggers. And I think the antiquities seller does not know the value of this dagger. So he you scammed him. I took my precautions this time and hit the dagger in the box. And I put the piece pieces in the scattered places so that Nadine does not take the dagger as I took the wish jar. Okay. Hello, lady. Was there anything more here? I think this was all done. So now we just... We leave this room and we need to figure out where to put the statue. Um, hold up, demon. Gotta read real quick. Was there something more up there? She's going back down the stairs. I have no idea where I'm supposed to put the statue. All right, we're we're out of here. Is there any other room that was locked? There was one more room that was locked upstairs. Do we burn it so we get the key? Oh, that's actually smart. Wait a minute. There was a fire somewhere. We should save first though, but there that sounds like a decent plan. Dining room and there's a fire here. Let's burn it because it will burn the wood, but not the, right? We're insane, but not the key. And then we get the key. I got the Necronomicon key. Uh, so now we still... I guess we do need to look up the hieroglyphs then. Because we haven't found... Oh, come on. There's got to be something in the... Oh, no, I'm dead. I'm going to die. I need to loop around the table. Follow me, lady. Hi. Wait, you don't see me? What the fuck is going on? 
Can I just close this door, by the way? That is so funny. Am I gonna die for this? <laughs> Wait, that actually works. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? I'm going back to the library. Leave me alone, lady. <laughs> She's still there. She's walking towards me. <laughs> So closing the doors is the best. There's gotta be some text in the library about the hieroglyphs, right? There has to be. There's no way that they require you to use Google to solve this puzzle. That would be insanely stupid. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything. No, like, shinies. Oh, there, never mind. There's a shiny there. Let's go. It's gotta be it. I love that all these books... Nope. Don't give a shit about any of this. That book right there, though, I know exactly that that is the book I have to pick up. Copies of the pages of the Book of the Dead. I got some prints from the pages of the Book of the Dead from a close friend of mine who works at the French Louvre. I studied it and discovered the great connection between it and the book Shams al Mara Mari. <laughs> Sorry, I can't pronounce that shit. <laughs> Whatever that was. Uh, that doesn't help me at all. Oh, there's a shiny. Yes, let's go. Come on, be good. There we go. Okay, it's a math equation. <laughs> okay, I see. So 900 is the one I see. Oh, it is a math equation. Are you fucking kidding me? We have to solve for X? Oh no, it's just the thousand. So the first one is a thousand. That one is a hundred. So nine of them is 900. Okay, so let's see. Pac-Man is 1000. Write it down. Finger we don't need, right? I don't think so. Maybe we need it. Wait, do we need, what do we need? Because we have this right here. So Pac-Man, this is 1,000. This was 100, right? So there is nine of them, which is 900. And then this was 10. I can now decode and find out the password for the safe. Why do you say it like that? Um, Yes, that is 10. So it's 1950. Okay, there we go. I'm assuming that's re that's the real hieroglyph, so we could have just uh, used Google, but I'm glad we used this. Also, there's more. I don't know what this is. There's something. Evil entity. Method to eliminate evil entities. The issue of cleansing the human body from evil entities is very difficult and beliefs differ from one people to another. And the situation varies with each incantation that is read. But what was clarified in the Book of the Dead is that it can be eliminated of these entities by using the holy dagger or by using certain hymn, um, hymns but these hymns need to need time and learning and there are also other means that you may find some of which are mutually beneficial all right i think that's all the shinies so now we have to go back to study on the second floor and open the safe save Sa we already know the code, right? We'll be fine. Oh, no, never mind. Save the game right now. <laughs> what the hell? These scripted events every time I get close to a new door. <laughs> Run to the save station. <laughs> what the hell, man? There she is. Run. Go, 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 go. She didn't see me. She didn't see me. Close the door. I don't think she hears very well. I don't know why you want to crouch. All right, now we open. One, nine, 50. There we now go. Now I have to go to the basement and open the chest. I'm assuming that is in the secret basement, but the pieces in the chest designated to take the dagger of the dead. Imagine having this big of a house and then also having a secret basement. What the fuck? What is this, by the way? This door obviously leads outside, but it is locked. How could it lead the outside when you've gone this far underground? I guess your house is like on a mountain or something. All right, dagger box, this one. Looks like it. All right, uh, put in... Okay, we just use them. Yes. I've done it. I got the Dagger of the Dead in a cassette tape. Wait, there was a cassette player somewhere. Anyone? It was in the library, right? Wasn't there a cassette player Your in the end library? Is near, you damn devil. Oh, you have to go there anyway to play the cassette tape, I see. Well, she's definitely gonna jump scare me somewhere. 
along the way here. This game is honestly pretty sick. Like, it's a little janky here and there, and the voice acting is obviously not perfect. It's pretty awesome. I guess way better than your average run-of-the-mill janky. Like, this is a good janky horror game. Most janky horror games are just janky, and then they're also bad. <laughs> this is janky good. I'm just gonna run to the library, because you can't- She's definitely gonna be here, and then it's gonna- We're gonna have to run all the way around. No? Alright, never mind then. Oh, she was at the window? I didn't see it. I'm the king of missing jump scares, it turns out. Once again. Oh. Here we go. That's an old but also fancy cassette player. <laughs> what the fuck? This bill that I will read now drains the devil's powers, and he will be unable to make Help me, God! The digger of the dead can also be used to cleanse possessed bodies. <laughs> God and I, Joe, starts playing. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what the is the stare? The use his dirty methods, such as seduction or manipulation of the feelings of others. And we must not believe what we see or hear. Come here, you filthy bastard. Stab. Hiya! Why would you show that so early? <laughs> She's speechless. What is this? Where did you get this dagger? Do you think you're going to get rid of me with this damn thing? So why are you afraid? Exorstimus Dei. Oh. Close the exorcism now. Close it. <laughs> Jesus. Didn't even need the dagger, huh? Is it gonna be a boss fight? Oh no. <laughs> Some kind of like Resident Evil stab fight that would have been so weird. Stab it! She's baiting you. Stab! Those big eyes. She used tricks. My daughter Selma. Don't trust the demon. you so much. Don't listen to their filthy tricks. Selma. Are you gonna kill your mother? <laughs> the fucking eyes. Uh, why are, are you gonna stab yourself? No. Die! <laughs> um, got him! <laughs> Let's go. She didn't fall for it. I love how this. Yeah, there we go. That's actually really good. <laughs> it was super. So that's made by one person alone. I really. That was like. It was janky, but it was like fun and it was funny when it was janky. Uh, there were some good animations here and there were obviously. Oh my god, it's the same person seven trillion times. Ha <laughs> I love when people, I love it when, that gives me like the same energy, you know when like you were doing a group project like in high school 
and like one person did like far more than the rest <laughs> and then they would put themselves like seven times on there and like <laughs> like the other people like twice <laughs> that's give me that energy all right anyway uh that was very good i i genuinely enjoyed that um janky here and there but in a good way uh, kind of like a uh, resident evil like but without any of the like branching paths and like long story it was just like solve these few puzzles oh we get we get a new name we get the cinematic soundtrack jesus christ <laughs> at this at this point like i don't know why you would do the <laughs> the credits like that when you just gonna when you just have one person doing everything there we go. Google Translate. Wait, why is some a Google Translator and some is Bing Translator? Wait, why is Portuguese why is Portuguese translated by Bing? <laughs> Wait, what did Bing do a better job? <laughs> That's so specific. <laughs> That's amazing. Alright, anyway, so I really enjoyed that. Let me know what you thought in the comments down below. I would love to hear. Uh, that was a great time all around, and I hope you enjoyed it as well. If you're not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. And if you want to join, I love the game machine in chat. You can join us over at twitch.tv slash Instagram. Click the link in the description down below. Thank you so much. I'll see you on the next one. Bye, guys. Have a good one. Bye-bye. <laughs>